Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm gonna be doing a collective haul. Over the last few weeks, I have been online shopping a little bit more than I should, and I just have quite a few things I wanna show you guys. So I have a few accessories, a pair of shoes, um, I have a little bit of lingerie to show you, and then just like general clothing. But I'm very excited. Um, I usually tend to go thrifting more, as you guys know, if you watch my channel, just because it's more sustainable, it's better for the environment, all that good stuff. But when you're in a lockdown and you're not working and you need something to do and you have some money to spend, I just, retail therapy is a thing, guys. And you know I've been going through a lot, so I treated myself in the last few weeks. But I'm really excited. I have a few things from H&M, from American Eagle, and from Shein. So if you guys want any of these things, I will do my best to link them down below. But thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe if you want to see more from me. And without further ado, let's get into it. So the first thing I actually wanted to show you, I'll start with American Eagle in general because I'm wearing one of their sets right now. So this one is like a little PJ set and it's just like the matching shorts and t-shirt. I love this little print. It gives me like Pioneer Girl vibes and I'm just a really big fan and it's so soft, so comfortable. I get everything there. If it's sized small medium large I usually get a large unless it says it's oversized in which case I'll get a medium but this is a size large so I love it it's so comfortable so soft and couldn't recommend it more and so the last thing for American Eagle that I picked up are actually a pair of jeans and I was pleasantly surprised by these so I've come to the conclusion that I'm just like a universal size and everywhere because I got basically that size from all these places and and ended up working out pretty well. So I just got these, they're their, um, they are their <laughs> like stretch mom jean in just like this basic blue color. And they're the perfect staple jean if you ask me. I love it, I love the button. The quality of American Eagle jeans is just amazing. I like that these ones do fit to your butt quite well but they're, but they're pretty loose as you go down. So I love wearing them to work, super stretchy and you can wear them you know, dress them up, dress them down, wear them with sneakers, or even wear them with heels and cuff them or something if you wanted, but regardless, these are a perfect pair of jeans, and I got them on sale for like $40, so that's not that bad. Now, moving on to H&M, I did only pick up three items, one of, two of which being the same thing, but in different colors, um, so I'll start with the pants. So I did get these pants in two different colors. They are this like tapered, it's basically a mom jean, but they call them pants, so they're tapered like mom jean pants, and I got them in just the black color here, and they have a similar vibe to the jeans I just showed, where they're just, they fit really well in the waist and, you know, make your butt look good, but then they're really loose and comfortable to wear while you're at work, or again, you can dress them up, dress them down, so I got them in black, and then I also got them in this really beautiful like khaki color, and they don't look like, you know, those dude pants with like the cuffs on the bottom that guys wear, they have a bit of like more structure to them. So I really enjoy this color and I've always wanted a pair of pants like this that actually fit my body well. So I'm very happy I picked those up. They do come in gray as well. So I'm kind of debating on getting those and they were a steal. They were literally only $20. So I picked up two, as I said. And then the last thing I got from H&M, I just feel like everyone needs this staple in their wardrobe and I plan on wearing it not even as like a fancy shirt necessarily but just in general like as a layer piece and it is this basic white button down so mine is a little bit different it doesn't have buttons all the way up it's like a v-neck version of that if you can see there but then it has buttons going down and I just thought that this shirt was going to be perfect for layering like baggy t-shirts over or vests or something because that's coming back in but then I can also wear it alone to like interviews or like special events if I have to and it's really good quality and I think I only paid like $14.99 for it. H&M was a really big success. I actually highly recommend checking out their website because their sale section and their home section is bomb. Speaking of which actually I did pick up these brown pillowcases from there and I am obsessed with them. They they're very pretty, but they have very aesthetic things on their home page, like home website page. But <laughs> I would really check out H&M. I really enjoyed them. And now moving on to the last place, which is Shein. So I'm going to end off the video with lingerie. Um, I'm obviously not going to be trying them on in this video, just an FYI, but I will show them. 
we're gonna start off probably with my favorite thing that I got from the website and guys I've wanted shoes like this for so long and at first I put them on and I was like damn it they don't fit but guys do you see these right now are those not the cutest little things ever they're like chunky platform oxford things loafers i don't even know but i just have wanted pairs of these for so long i did ideally obviously want like doc martin versions but i'm not willing to pay an arm and a leg so these were 25 dollars and they're just so aesthetic and they're actually really lightweight which i appreciate because wearing them to work they won't feel too heavy on my feet like my docs do but yeah i got them in a size 38 which is like a size seven, seven and a half, and they're a little bit big, but they do fit quite well. So I'm really excited to style those. It's definitely like a different piece in my wardrobe, but very exciting. The next thing that I picked up is kind of similar to the white shirt from H&M, but it is this super, super oversized black version of it. It's super comfortable. I, again, I'm gonna be using this as like a layering piece, but I could even wear this by itself with like leggings or something, because it's so long and again just super comfortable but it can also be dressed up if you need it to be um i don't know i got it in a size medium but it's like really big and really long i could probably even wear it as a dress or like put shorts under it and like try and style it as a dress in the summer um but yeah i really like this one you can definitely hear in the material that this isn't as good of quality as the other one but that's what you get when you order from shein so just saying <laughs> um i'm pretty sure this shirt was like under 15 dollars and Again, it's going to be a really good staple in my wardrobe. Next up, we got another pair of jeans, and I was pleasantly surprised by these because when I order anything jean or pant from Shein, which has not been often, but when I have, it never works out, or I just am not really sure what size I am, even if I measure myself, and these ones fit me perfectly, so I was, I was very surprised. Again, with the quality of Shein, you know, the zipper's not the best, it's nowhere near American Eagle or H&M, but the pants themselves are very cute. I have been wanting a pair of jeans like this in this color for so long and they are like full length and everything, which I really appreciate. I love that they have pockets and I like that they have like this tapered detailing at the top and on the, bot on the butt they have some detailing on the pockets, which is really fun. But I've just been really wanting jeans in this color and I think that they just hug my body really well. So very happy that I picked those up. So the last actual clothing piece I'm going to be showing you guys is a vest and I think this is my favorite clothing piece that I got. I don't know, it kind of, it just screams me and I'm just obsessed with it. So it is this oversized knit vest in like this brown color and this is going to look, I already know it looks because I tried it out, but it's going to look amazing over that white collared shirt. And then it can also look really good on its own with like a cute skirt and maybe even those like loafers or something. Oof, that's a look. Um, I'm really excited to just style it because I have two or three other vests, but they're not as oversized as this one. And I just, this one is just fully my aesthetic. So I love the white stripes on it. Kind of gives it that varsity look. And yeah, this one, I believe, this was a bit expensive. I think this was like 20 $22.99 or $25.99 or something, but regardless, I think it was worth it. It's actually a really good material. It actually feels pretty warm, so if you wanted to wear it in the winter, fall, or spring or something, pretty good for that. But yeah, that is the last clothing piece. So I'm gonna go into a little bit of accessories. I did get three different necklaces because I just was feeling some more necklaces. I used to wear this specific necklace and now I just don't feel right wearing it so I needed some more to kind of fill that void for me but this one here I'm gonna bring it up close so this one here is like a three layered necklace and I think it's gorgeous I love that it has the thick band here but then it also has a little thin one and then along with the little like dime shape pendant but I'm really into gold jewelry and I really love how this looks so it's just like a simple way to add more to your outfit especially this because it's just like all put together simple good to go you don't need to add anymore but if you want to you can i'm really happy with the way this one looks i also picked up this more chunky gold chain and i think it's very cute and all of this stuff obviously isn't real gold so it's super light which is kind of nice because i feel like if i had a real gold chain this thick it would be super heavy on my neck but yeah 
still looks pretty dainty but at the same time a little edgy and I like that and this last one is a little bit daintier and girlier I love the way this looks I think it's just so gorgeous this is like the perfect necklace to wear with like a dress in the summer or something in my opinion I just think it looks a lot more elegant than the other chains I showed but again I am a big fan I'll probably layer this one with the other chunky one or something but yeah that is the last necklace I got and now ending off this video with a little bit of lingerie um, again I'm not gonna try this on for the video but I'm just gonna show it because I think it's really cute and <laughs> if you guys are looking for really inexpensive lingerie I would highly recommend going on to Shein or something but I, I picked up two pieces first one being this like see-through little polka dotted number and then it has a pair of matching little underwear with like a bow and I just thought that was really cute um, I have heard from a few friends that their wiring like their wired lingerie is a little bit sketchy because they're not a bra site obviously so both of these items are like more loungy wear lingerie if that makes sense but yeah so I picked up this one which is just a very basic and then I got a super colorful one which is very cute um, and it's this one here so looks like that in the top just has like it's just all see-through and then has these super cute flowers all over it and then the bottoms are actually like little like booty short underwear type deal but I'm just obsessed with this I think it's so cute and like very me for lingerie it's something that I would actually want to wear all the time just because it makes me feel happy so those are the lingerie pieces I got and that is everything in this haul so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys are interested in any of the pieces like I said I will try and link all of them down below unless they're sold out I try not to shop too too much and I would say overall this haul probably costed me under $300 so that's pretty good for how much stuff I got if you guys want to see more hauls from me please let me know I would love to do more thrift hauls once my store open, opens up I I'm in desperate need of some thrifting therapy, so I might do that. And if you guys want to see any other videos in general, just let me know. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe, like this video, and turn on your post notifications if you want to see more from me. I'll see you in the next one.